here's this week's balcony garden update for Sunday, August 8th, 2021. As this tomato plant becomes more mysterious week after week, we've still got some nice tomatoes growing on it. We do have some more green ones, which means that it's still growing tomatoes. So even though the plant doesn't look 100% healthy, there's a lot of brown, look like dead leaves. I've already pulled off a ton of dead leaves. But it's still growing tomato. So that's a good thing. Here's the lone orange cherry tomato plant in the balcony, which is again bizarre. Still have one red tomato on it. And I'm going to pick that shortly as it is ready. And you can see we still have flowering and more tomatoes growing on this plant. We have another green one over here. So this plant is starting to produce more tomatoes. Now what I've done in noticing that this plant needed a little help was I added some banana peels. I'm going to show you here to the soil. I buried some in the soil and I left a little bit more on top. Now that's obviously attracting more bugs and whatnot, but it's making the plant grow and it's getting more tomatoes now. So maybe it just needed those extra nutrients. All right, so let's venture over to my sister's place and see what kind of success we have this week. So here's the tomato plants. Here's the first one. You can see it's got cherry tomatoes on it. This is pretty cool that it was grown from seed. Got lots and lots of tomatoes on it. It's growing all the way up here. If we go down here, you can see on the side, and you can see some orange tomatoes. second plant's also got lots of tomatoes on it. You can see these ones are all green, but maybe another week or two and it should all change color. Now this is the third one here. You can see it's got flowers all over it. It's got tomatoes. say that looks like a watermelon. And here we have the alapino plant. It's still growing alapinos, but for some reason it's just not producing as much as I thought it would. Hmm. I like to show progress and unfortunately as far as the red pepper plants go not making any peppers They're just a lot of green leaves and although they do grow a little bit taller that's about it and there's just some regular tomato plants that are growing And I thought I'd show a shot of these um, red onions. They're also very nice with it. Not popping above the ground there. And the alapino plant. Remember this J shaped one? That one's ready to be picked now. I picked all the other red ones. For all you lucky ones out there who got some jalapenos from me, I hope you're enjoying them. We've still got lots more growing. This plant just keeps growing them, so this plant is definitely a success this year. And this one with the one pepper again. I believe this pepper is ready to be picked soon. Well, we'll wait and see if we get any more from this plant, because this one doesn't seem to be doing anything still. Now this one's kind of exciting. This is the one Hungarian pepper. As you can see, it has now turned red and it is ready to be picked. So I'm gonna pick that and see how it came out. And with any luck, maybe this plant will grow another pepper. Just as I thought we'd written off strawberry season, this plant has grown a strawberry. And it doesn't seem to be doing much more. 
plant itself does not look that healthy and although we've got some nice mint growing through it um, hasn't really produced strawberries this year so as far as strawberries go this one has not been a success and the onions are still growing nicely and they have been a great success this time it doesn't look like we have any formed garlics under the soil yet here so I'll have to leave this for longer past the summer let it keep growing although I do have the greens that can be pulled off and used as chives so that is an advantage and over here that was the lemon seed and this plant does keep growing but it's just a little bit of leaves so that's that it's nice to see that the onions have been a success so have the tomato plants all right, that's it for this week's update. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next week.